Nigeria has invested heavily into providing critical public infrastructure for its citizens. These fundings have gone into projects such as road, rail, bridges, and of course airports. In the year 2000, Nigeria had about 23 public airports located in 22 states and the Federal Capital Territory, leaving about 14 states without any. Many of these airports were developed by various head of state during the Nigerian military era. On the return of democracy in 1999, the federal government has completely shifted focus on building airports at least one in every state of the federation. This move has pushed many left out states who were not privileged to have hosted airport projects during the military era to independently develop their own public airports without the assistance of the federal government. In 2022, these are the top 10 brand new and ongoing airport projects in Nigeria undertaken by state government. Eboin State International Airport The Eboin State International Airport is a massive airport project undertaken by the administration of engineer Dave Umayi in Eboin State. The project is being constructed in Eza North local government area of the state and is expected to be completed later this year. The project recently received an applaud from the Minister of Aviation, Senator Hadri Serika, describing it as a worthwhile project that will open up the state to both domestic and international investment. It is worth noting that Ebony State Government is collaborating with Ethiopia Airlines for direct international flights into Ebony, which will improve tourism and businesses. Aside from the regular structures in an airport, the project also features a police station, a presidential lodge, an airport road and a flower bridge. The airport apron is being constructed with one feet concrete pavement, which guarantees the airport to last for more than 50 years. Its runway is about 3.4 kilometers in length and it's also constructed with concrete. Anambra International Cargo Airport the Anambra International Cargo Airport is a recently completed airport project situated in Umweri, Anambra State. The airport functions for both domestic and cargo services. It features one of the most modern airport facilities and terminal building in Nigeria. It also features a 3.7 km runway, which makes it the second longest in Nigeria after the Lagos Airport. The airport project was funded under a build, operate, manage and transfer agreement where a 75% equity stake was granted to elite international investment which funded majority of the project, 20% to Orient Petroleum Resources and 5% to the state government of Anambra. Bayelsa International Airport the Bayelsa International Airport is a new airport facility in Yenogua, the Bayelsa state capital. The project was initiated and completed under the administration of Sirak and Dixon, but remained idle for over two years. In 2021, a full comprehensive assessment was carried out on the airport by the Nigerian Civil Aviation Authority and the necessary licenses were granted to begin commercial operations. Ibom Air and United Nigerian Airlines have both commenced flight to and from the airport. Still, the airport remains one of the least patronized in Nigeria. Lafia Cargo Airport Lafia Cargo Airport is a multi billionaire airport project that was recently commissioned by the President Muhammad Buhari in 2022. For a cargo airport, it features a relatively short runway length of 2.1 km. But there are plans to extend it to 2.5 kilometers. The project restarted in 2015 by the administration of Umar Tanko Al Makora was completed by the current governor of Nasarawa State, engineer Abdullah Suli. Since its inauguration, the airport has not received any commercial flights and remains idle to date. Yubi International Cargo Airport the Yubi International Cargo Airport is a new airport project in Damaturu, the Yubi state capital. The project they backed upon in 2017 cost the state government at least 18 billion naira. The airport is also a flagship project of Governor's Boni's administration. The project is in its final phase of completion and will be used for mostly agricultural cargo services and for passenger transport. 
Ogun Agro Cargo Airport. The Ogun Agro Cargo Airport is a brand new airport project under construction in Ogun State, Nigeria. The airport is strategically located in the center of the state where there are two important highways. On the western side, the Legacy Baran Expressway, and on the southern side, you have the Shangamu Bidin Expressway. The facility is built to primarily handle cargo services and agencies like the Nigerian Customs Service have indicated interest to be established within the airport. The airport will include an international testing center where all agro produce that go out of Nigeria will be certified as complying with international standards. The airport will also serve as a cargo alternative to the Lagos Airport. Victor Atta International Airport Victor Atta International Airport is a completed airport project in Akwa Ibom State. The airport project which was completed in 2009 has undergone various levels of upgrades. In 2012, a maintenance overhaul and repair facility was added to the airport. Today, a new international and smart terminal is under construction within the airport to handle international flights. There are also plans to include cargo handling facilities as well. The airport is the major hub of the state-owned Ibom Air, which operates state-of-the-art aircraft including the Airbus A320neo. Dusey International Airport Dusey International Airport is an airport serving Dusey, the capital of Jigawa State. The project was embarked upon by the former governor of Jigawa State and was commissioned in 2014 by the former president, Goodluck Jonathan. Currently, the airport has no commercial operation but is often used for pilgrim airlift to Saudi Arabia and for VIP travel. Obudu Cargo Airport the Obudu Cargo Airport is an ongoing cargo airport in Obudu Cross River State. The airport is a priority project of the current governor of Cross River State, Dr. Ben Ayadi. Despite the presence of an existing, functional, and underutilized airport within the state capital, the Margaret Airport International Airport, Dr. Ben Ayadi justifies the construction of a new airport to boost the tourism of the state and to enable the export of agricultural products harvested within the state. A notable feature of the proposed airport is its runway length. The Obudu Airport project features a 5.6 km runway length. This length completely dwarfs the Lagos Airport runway length, which is about 3.9 km, and the current title order of the longest airport runway in the entire world, China's Kwando Banda Airport with a runway length of 5.5 km. The summary of all this is that if the Obudu Airport project is successfully completed, it will host the longest runway in the entire world with a length of 5.6 km. Ekiti Airport The Ekiti State Agro Allied Cargo Airport is an airport project currently under construction in Ekiti State, Nigeria. The project began its construction in 2019 and is scheduled for completion in 2022. It features a 3.2 km runway, which is enough to accommodate all sizes of passenger and cargo aircraft. The project is being sponsored by the administration of Governor Coyote Fayemi, and he has promised to deliver the project before the expiration of his tenure later this year. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and share with your friends. My channel is focused on infrastructure, development, massive projects and updates across the continent of Africa. If that's something that interests you, then try subscribing to WebNova Africa, hit the bell notification and I will see you on the next one. Peace.